So the first thing you do is find something cool to scan. We really, really like this conch shell because it has a really awesome, like, natural organic form. It's it's got a lot of really pointy points to, or like pointy like spikes to it. Um, it's got some different differences in color and texture, and it even has this kind of like cavity in here. So it provides a lot of challenges, and really, a really, it's a really good test for for this for this machine. So you'll see now the laser turned on. The turntable is rotating, and it's actually rendering the data that it's getting in real time on the screen. It does one full rotation, gets one point cloud. Another full rotation gets another one. Two independent meshes that then get aligned together, and then you have basically just kind of 3D points floating in space that have to be connected with triangles, and that's this mesh reconstruction algorithm that uh, is just is really, really robust. And it will automatically give you a 3D printable, fully closed mesh. No fixing, no stitching, nothing required, just ready to go right out of the scanner, which we're, we really built in as a sort of functionality because we wanted to flow really, really well into the printer. Um, <clears throat> so let's, let's, we can talk a little bit about how it works. This is called a sheet of light triangulation scanner. Now what that means is it projects a sheet of light, sounds scarier than it is, it projects a sheet of light onto your object, and then that sheet of light is then reflected back into your camera, and then the word, kind of, the word triangulation kind of gives away how it works, because it triangulates the points here by knowing the geometry of where the laser is, where the camera is, and where your object is, it makes a triangle. And then you can you know, do the, the math to solve for that triangle, you can find all the, all the legs, and you can find where that point is in space.